Hi Aries, this is going to be your general love, wealth, health reading for the month of May. You've got come to the edge, possibly take a leap of faith regarding something or someone. Um, thank you for liking and subscribing to my channel, Tarot Dreams 88. I do have three other channels as well. You've got the kangaroo, be a force for good. So yes, I do have three other channels as well. Dream Infinity 88, Dream Infinity Brand 88. Please like and subscribe to them if you want to. Let's quickly pull you your crystal, your gemstone card for the month of May. Larimar, water, ocean. This might mean that you possibly need to take a break, Aries. Um, I do understand within the Aries season, you guys have been very, very busy and working a lot during the Aries season. Okay, let's really see with your health card with Archangel Raphael. What does Aries need to know? going ahead for the month of May I'm just asking for important questions for Aries relationship dear Archangel Raphael thank you for healing and guiding all of my relationships upon the path of love so yeah I'm just asking for the most important questions that you guys need to know going into the month of May what does Aries need to know for the month of May important messages your commitment is being tested Possibly you will know where this commitment is realizing. It can be in your career. It can be in your love connection. Let's quickly see what does your throat, not your throat, your chakra card have for you, Aries. Base chakra, the first chakra. I create stability and security by adequately providing myself with the basic needs of a healthy life such as shelter food water and clothing i use my creativity to build a strong foundation as this is an essential key to my survival and growth okay Iris, let's really see what does the tarot have for you so you are in my free time I create Oracle and um, the Norman and Tarot card decks on an online shop platform. The link will be in the description box below. I'm going to shuffle and split the cards for you, Aries. This is what you see. What is, does Aries need to know? Important messages. Okay, so this card went flying. Just hold on one second. Okay, so you possibly have a water sign person. It might be a love connection. It might be someone that you work with. Then you've got the Page of Pentacles. Let's quickly see what else does Aries need to know. What else does Aries need to know for the month of May? Okay. Your general energy for the month, Aries, is a two of cups. Okay, so let's quickly see and have a discussion 
regarding this reading Aries okay so what I can see for you is it's asking you to come to the edge possibly taking a leap of faith this can be regarding a job matter it can be regarding a love matter a family matter take a leap of faith be a force for good and you people that are Aries are very in a good way forceful people you work and get what you want and and this is I think relating with you guys as well water and ocean I do feel that it might be regarding this water sign person that's coming towards you either with a love offer it might also mean yeah, someone with either water in the chart or a water sign person Pisces Scorpio Cancer or it might mean Aries that you are thinking and contemplating of going away a bit towards the, o the ocean or a, you know a dam or something <coughs> sorry about that then you've got the first chakra the base chakra and it's asking you to basically create your own stability and security for yourself adequately that you can live a healthy life and shelter and that I do feel it's for some Aries people that's got their own businesses as well um, that it's very important for you to be able to create your own shelter and water and clothing for you and your family I mean that is what you're working towards because you are a force for good you've got the relationship card from Archangel Raphael and standing you regarding this that you have got blessed relationships and um, blessed people currently within your current circle you are blessed when it comes to relationships your commitment is being tested and this might not resonate for everyone um, but this might mean that your commitment in your work might be tested your commitment in your current love connection might be tested um, it might mean that a third party person will try to come in and cause ructions and unnecessary unhappiness in your current love relationship and that's why this is like a heads up if you are in a committed situation I do feel that you might if you are a own business owner or currently you know working in your career you might be presented with a bonus or incentive or some money that will come your way um, but it's coming in very slowly this might also mean a love offer from a possible water sign coming towards you a Pisces Scorpio cancer person you do have and a lot of the a lot of the zodiac signs got the justice or the judgment or the four of swords card or the wheel of fortune if this is regarding a legal matter or contracts or a court case I do feel that justice will be in your favor and everyone will be served you know in their fair right it also feels that justice like I said is in your favor y'all but before you need to sign a contract think things through work it through do not just sign impulsively Aries, I do feel and it's not for all of you that you are currently going through a death and rebirth of a cycle. It can be in your current relationship, it can be in your current work, it can be in your family situation. Um, this might mean that, and that's why it's possibly asking you with this card, take a leap of faith, come to the edge possibly trying something new that you never thought of in a business in a love connection in a love relationship if it's in a love relationship someone will present you with their cup of love this is also the soulmate card this might mean as well a past soulmate person might return you are thinking and contemplating and a lot up in your head about something it might be regarding a work situation a love connection Aries you might have sleepless nights you might feel depressed you might feel anxiety as well but with this card you see there's an owl there 
And Aries is basically telling you that within yourself, you are able to have the wisdom and the clarity regarding this matter that is bothering you. But first, you need to clear this energy of anxiety first. Then you are going to see the matter that might be bothering you more clear. Um, I do see messages and information coming in for you very soon with this page of swords. This might as well be someone within your current circle that is spying on you. Because they are the messengers. Someone, if this is a new love connection, they are basically um, checking you out on your social media. But also, in a other situation, it might mean that someone is in a bad way spying on you. Checking you out, you know, um, to get information about you. So just be a bit, um, yeah, just have this in mind. It depends on how it resonates for everyone. But yeah, I mean, your relationships are blessed. Um, because you... Archangel Raphael and God has blessed your relationships going forward. Be the force for good. Yeah. Upon the path of love. If you decide to go away for a weekend or taking some time off, it is indicating that you possibly will do that. Um, you would like to go to a watery place um, where your mind can possibly find some calming effect and calmness. But yeah, I think the big thing for you Aries for this month in May is to come to the edge. Take a leap of faith in some sort of, inform, you know, situation, love, connection, family, work. Let's quickly see if you are currently in a committed connection. Um, what do you need to know? Okay. Okay. You've got the card. Unhealed wounds are affecting the future this will not resonate for everyone but for some Aries people out there it might mean that you need to let go of the past to be able to move on this might also mean that someone played you in the recent past um, let's quickly see let's get another card I am in love with someone else. This might be you or them. And this is not going to resonate for everyone as the same. Let's get you another message. Use your intuition. Think deep. Go inwards. And I feel with this card. And the water card. Water and ocean. You will get information. You will get the clarity you need. If you can get out of this energy of the Nine of Swords. So Aries, yeah, this is just a heads up for the month of May. Thank you for tuning in. Please like and subscribe. Stay safe. Look after yourself and your family. Bye.